The Tata Safari facelift has been undergoing testing for a considerable period, and Tata Motors aims to introduce a fresh design language for its flagship Harrier and Safari models, drawing inspiration from the Harrier EV concept and the Curve E concept. Recently, the interior of the new Safari has been captured. Notably, it features a new two-spoke steering wheel with logo illumination, wrapped in leather, reminiscent of the one found in the Nexon facelift. The main infotainment system and fully digital instrument cluster are expected to be similar to those seen in the Red Dark Edition. Tata has implemented a new design for the AC vents at the center console, adopting a modern theme. The rest of the dashboard remains largely unchanged from the outgoing model, though it's likely that the new touch and toggle climate control panel from the Nexon facelift will be incorporated. Beneath the control panel, there is a new knob with a display on top, possibly used to control ESP Advanced Terrain Response Modes. This knob is likely to resemble the one found in the Nexon EV Max. Speaking of gear selectors, the Tata Safari facelift gets a smaller and more sophisticated unit for its automatic variants. While the door pads appear identical to the outgoing model, we can anticipate a new color theme and upholstery. The features are expected to be carried over, as the Safari already offers a comprehensive package, particularly in its Red Dark version. As for the exterior, we can anticipate design changes such as a new front fascia, with full-width LED DRLs and a split headlamp setup, LED connecting tail lamps, and the likelihood of new 19-inch alloys. Powertrain options are likely to include a 2-liter diesel engine, generating 170 PS, and 350 newton meter of torque, as well as a new 1.5 liter turbo petrol engine producing 170 PS and 250 newton meter of torque. The launch is expected to occur during the festive season. Have a great day. Stay subscribed to Auto Comparo. Thanks for watching.